Hi everyone, today I thought I'd show you the um, new version of FF Manager, version 3. It took a long time to make this, so I go. I hope you guys appreciate it. Um, first, um, I would like to say this does work for Mac, Windows, and Linux, so Mac users, Linux users and such can use this. You have an FF viewer for Mac and you have an FF viewer for Linux, just saying that. Now, to start off, uh, go to ffviewer.com and you'll see this. You just click on the link, your asset manager on net. Um, if you don't have an account, you need to register. I am logged in. Once you're done, just click FF Manager, and then from what you can, and then you'll get a nice interface right here. Now, from what you can, now as you can see, I have some people that have shared some fast files to me. What that means is they added me as an editor to their fast file. Um, editor is a feature where you can allow another member, your, uh, your friend, your mining partner, someone, um, whoever to um, edit your fast file, um, rename uh, the files inside the fast file, and even download as well. Um, and yes, a patch is a fast file for anyone who's wondering. A patch mp underscore, a patch underscore mp ff is a fast file. So to start off, um, you can either add, add a fast file from template, which you can choose a number of different ones right here. For example, War War for Xbox, PlayStation 3. Let's do the Xbox for now, I guess. And then you add it. And then, oh, my, my pop up pop, my pop up blocker blocked it. But right here, you can just go to View. And then, you'll see this nice interface. It'll, and it'll show it's loading. And now you see this. If you notice as well, you have these themes. You can switch the theme of the interface in both places. So from what you see right here, you have your things. But this is designed to look like Gekka If you notice, you have all your GSCs or in CFG files, all your raw files and such right here to view. You have your max size. And your current and your current size. If this was the NW2 patch, uh, then it would have the like, compressed and uncompressed as well. Um, so you can scale in it here. So let's say if I want to go into class, I want to pack. Uh, I I can strip all the comments. I just get some room, and I can go and save changes. Now for this. You must save changes for the save the fast file. On prior, on this, um, what you guys may be used to is edit and compress. Save changes is pretty much editing the file, and compress is basically saving the fast, save fast file. <coughs> Sometimes it might lag on saving, just give it a second and let it do its thing. And then once it's done, go save that. Once it's done, go save that. Files it may take a bit, just be patient. And then when you're done, you just can go back right here and click and go and click downward. See? And down your file. You can also down the IWD of it. Yeah, so I think that's pretty cool. Now you can also pack the code as normal, like always, and it just packs it up. There is no um, formatter because a because a code formatter for this would be highly complex to write, sadly. But it is very simple to do. Now you guys might be wondering how you rename. Yeah, there's no like visible place to rename. Well, take a well, take in a page from FF Viewer, right click on any uh, GSC or CFG file, and click rename. And then you can go and rename the, 
Class, so change your class, CFG, rename, and then, see, and it renames. So, this is all very simple, and then, and save the class file. And then exit. Now, as, as um, the rest of the features, going down through here, you, you've already gone through IWD. Now, main is sharing. This is a feature that not many people will take advantage of, and it's kind of sad. Well, in my opinion, at least. So, what you can do here is this is like make upload, media fire, or where, where file share. So what you can do is say you want to release your patch or your mod or something to people. And what you can do here is you can check this, press update, and then you get and then you get a download right here. If you add, if you get that link to anyone, they will be able to download the fast file. And now that's enabled, you get a counter as well. So you see how many downloads of the file you have. And if you any time you want to make it non-downloadable, aka you don't want to put it down stuff anymore, just uncheck it, update, and click out and disable. Um, so you can pretty much uh, share these files out, and the and the benefit to that is that say you go and you need to view this again, and you need to modify something. Um, so wait for this stuff. Uh, and you need to mod and you want to modify something. Um, tools pack code. And I just type something here. And you want to modify it. You can save changes. Save fast style. And then while, and then while it's enabled, And while this is enabled, if you edit it, next person they you download it, just get the version. You don't have to read up the word. Now, as for file share, um, by default, anyone who's a guest, just a uh, random person, you'll have to wait 30 seconds to download. Uh, if you're just by registering though, you get only 15 seconds. And if you buy a subscription, well, you get a gold name, you get a increased uh, uh, account code. Agency mine is unlimited because I'm, because that, uh, that's me. I set that to that. And if you have, uh, you get a update, an increased quota, code name, and you get no weights on um, downloading anyone else's files. Now, as a note, if you allow someone to down your file via the editor, it will not count towards your sharing. Sharing only applies to people who use a public share link. And if you use a public share link while logged in, then it won't count to you either. So, continuing on, right here, if you have this right here, you can type whatever you want. You can use BB code and you can save it, just whatever, update. And you can edit editors. So, if I want to add, if I want to add 50 tracks, I can have him edit. I want him to rename my files. You can download, I can add him. Yeah, and then I can update his permissions if I want to. I can update his permissions, and if I want to, I just delete them. So yeah, and that allows other people to view and edit your stuff. Uh, now, main the zone. What this is is if you want to, you can download the the. A zone file for this fast file. Now, for those who don't know what that is, if you remember that dot dat method here, that's pretty much what this is. 
Wait for it. Fast five, and it always challenges the fast, fast five up zone. And then afterwards, you can re-upload the zone, back upward. Granted, it might take a bit to upload, so just be patient on it. And then now, for this, there's no fast files. There's no one I have. But if you, if I had another like uh, X card where, where um, PS3, I could copy all the raw files and even the names over, and I can basically copy the fast file. If something happens to it, or it's also used for as, a, as what you might refer to as a patch converter, as people call it. And then, well. If I need it, well, let's just delete it. And it's gone. Now, um, I believe so. Now I have all these different things that I can do down with, some I can only down with from people. So yeah. Oh yeah, and the cool feature of this thing is is you can search different um, for different files right here. So for example, I if I want to one dot one thirteen, then it will bring it up automatically. So it says in built in search right there, and you can show number of entries and stuff. Now, another cool feature now is the bulk options menu. This allows you to select all the visible ones, clear it all, and you can disable sharing in mass, enable sharing in mass, delete all the editors for multiple files. And delete no, uh, all the ones selected. Um, now, for that, how you do that is let me just go ahead and add this. Add this real quick. Um, basically, right here. Who's it, mate? Oh, web browser shows up. Right here, I can check it, and then I can. Disable sharing, en enable sharing, delete all editors, clear all, select all, delete, and it'll mass delete them. So that's pretty cool. It allows you to do things mass bulk. Now, if I ask for upload your own fast file, you just type a name for it, choose a file or something like that. Choose the console, upload it, yeah. Pretty simple. Well, FF Manager supports PS3, Xbox, Wii, um, PC, all of them. Cloud 4, Cloud 5, NW2, supports Black Ops and NW3 for Wii. So, yeah. Um, hope you enjoyed this. I uh, hope you get a very good use of this tool. Uh, I encourage you to use the file share. It's very useful and very convenient. And I'll see you guys around. Peace out.